Well, uh, I noticed it again as I pulled into my garage yesterday that uh, the trees in my backyard, which I love 90% of the time, specifically in the summer, because they provide shade, now those trees are losing their leaves. And if I said that it took probably 20 to 30 of the City of Muscatine bags to put all the leaves in, I wouldn't be exaggerating. It is a nightmare. (laughs) But wait, what if someone could do all that for me? Ah, that's the ticket. Lincoln Lawn Care and our buddy Shane's right there. What's up, dude? You could do all that for me, really? You're too nice. I could. Nice. What do I have to do? Give you money or what? Of course. (laughs) That's how that works. Um, It's crazy. Now, like the trees around the radio station, we look out the window right now. They're losing a few leaves, buddy. Uh, But soon... This whole place is going to be littered with them. Exactly. It's part of living in the Midwest. It happens, right? Yep. You're in the business to where you can come by and and take care of people. That's right. In all sorts of fall preparation. So if I'm thinking about my yard, front, back, what are what are some things that I could do, um, or more specifically, what are some things that y'all can come in and do for people? Because there's other things like you said, aeration in the fall, and I didn't think that that would happen. Yeah, it's getting a little late in the year to do that, but mm-hmm. it's not never too late to do that. So okay. we do all that and we cool. can, you know, obviously we come by free quote as usual, it's always yeah. free. Um, you know, you need to clean out your flower beds before winter time. Mm-hmm. Get your bushes, give them a haircut before the winter time. <laughs> yeah, give them a buzz, right? I yeah, mean, <laughs> give give them a nice little <laughs> shortcut for the winter time. Oh, I love it. Um, what else? Like uh, do some weeding for sure, right? Might as well get rid of them if, if, if you can before it freezes, right? Yeah, your hostas, your mm-hmm. daylilies, get them all cut down for the winter. Yeah. And uh, if you want to dig some of them out, kind of separate them a little bit, you can do that in the spring too, but this way you kind of get rid of some of them as well. Cool. Because they get pretty big. Yes, they do. Um, in my backyard, we have so we got two trees, great shade, like I said. But then along the fence line, there's something that looks like a tree, and it's not. I think it's some type of is it like a mulberry something that's not good. It's a volunteer. It's probably a Chinese maple, or Chinese need to elm. Get rid of it, right? Yeah, they're they're pain in the rear. Yeah, I got some in my house too. <laughs> it looks like it could be a tree, but then you're like, you're not a tree, man. You're like a weed tree, aren't you? Yep. And not like a Cheech and Chong weed tree, I should clarify. This is something that is like sucking nutrients from the ground, not cool. So I need to take that down. Again, uh, Lincoln Lawn Care could do everything for you. Cut the grass, edge it, give the bushes a haircut, give the thorn bushes a haircut. That's a painful job that I have. Oh, my gosh. Yep. And then uh, I know it's a bad word, but... uh Snow. Right. And uh, we, we put up your holiday decorations for you if you don't want to do it. That's it's cool. Pretty pretty easy. It's pretty, actually, it's pretty reasonably priced. Yeah. Some people are just afraid to because it's like, oh, that's going to be crazy expensive. But sure. Give us a call. Text me, you know, 299 7181, and uh, we'll come out and give you a quote. And uh, you never know how much it's going to be. It doesn't hurt to get a quote. Right. No, it doesn't. Could you make my house look like uh, Clark Griswold's? No. <laughs> I could, but I I don't think you make enough of the radio station to pay for that. Oh, you'd be surprised how many millions I make sitting here. I got that I got that Dwyer and Michaels money. No, I'm just kidding. I'm not rich. Um, but yes, if you had uh, if you had some decorations, and you're right, maybe you just uh, you don't trust yourself on a ladder. I didn't know you guys did that until you said that right before we went on the air. I was like, oh, that's cool. Yeah, we've been doing that for a few years. I mean, it's awesome. it's kind of you can supply the lights. Mm-hmm. We'll put them up. We'll take them down. What do you use to put up lights? You staple gun? What do you got? Tape, uh, duct tape, glue. What are you using? A little bit of everything. Okay. What is it? A secret? Of How course. You hang lights? Of what do you got? Course. A competitor that's doing this too? Uh, I don't know. I don't uh, think so. Likely. I don't know. It, it's trade secrets. I Look can't get them all out. All right. I can understand if you had like a secret to aerating a yard. All right. Fine. He doesn't use a staple gun or nails or screws or duct tape or rubber bands or chewed up glue. It's something else. That's that's the redneck way, I think. <laughs> or it's a combination of all of them. It's Gorilla Glue, isn't it? I knew it. You got me. You got me. Now, what about like the obnoxious inflatable Christmas decorations? If I have those, you'll get those set up for me. And Anything you want, anything you got. Nice. So what's uh, give me an example of a house where you showed up and then you left and it was like Christmas, a little winter wonderland. Uh, we did uh, a couple of them. One in particular, we did uh, the Sheets residence over on Stonebrook. Okay. And... Um, 
actually didn't take that long, and he was kind of surprised by how little it cost. Nice. So he supplied the lights, and uh, we put them up. That's great. Now, are you going like on the roof with lights, or are you just kind of doing like the ones that hang over? What, whatever you want. I mean, wow. if you want the trees wrapped, you want your ah, posts wrapped. Good call, right. Gutters hanging on the yeah. icicle lights on the gutters, just a little <laughs> bit of everything. Oh, man, your crew is probably like, I wish we would not have to go all put up lights. We love it. Merry Christmas. <laughs> exactly. It's like, get up there. I'm paying you the big bucks. Come on. Let's do it. Um, no, I love it. So uh, your season really doesn't stop. It just you modify what's going on. Yep. Okay. Now, what about when it's like February? What are you doing in February? You taking a break? You pushing snow? What are you doing? If it's not snowing, we're taking a break. Okay, good. <laughs> when it's 30 below, Lincoln Long Care is chilling out for a little bit. Um, well, if you've been to the radio station over the past, what have you been helping us out for? Like eight months now, maybe? Yeah, since about April-ish, March-ish. Okay. So if you've been to the station sometime between now and uh, April, you've noticed how good it looks here. And I mean that. I mean, when I pull in every day and I see the line of bushes along the side of the building, they're all even and they're uniform and they look good. So I, I know that you all do a great job. It's just a matter of people uh, making the call. It's not that you're lazy or that you can't do it. Maybe you just, you've been trying to get that one bush to look good. And, <laughs> and for whatever reason, you just can't. You take a step back and you're like, I must have closed my eyes when I trimmed that. Yeah, it's kind of one of those things. You got your honeydew list and you yeah. can kind of secretly cross it <laughs> off. Just make sure you tell your wives that we are coming. We had something <laughs> last week and she didn't know we were coming. Woo! So we kind of had to put that on hold for a minute until they... Uh, <laughs> Chatted with each other that night, and it's like, whoops, sorry about that. Uh, that would be me, except I'd be like, huh? I'd be like, baby, 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 baby. You see all those leaves in the backyard? And then she'd be like, mm-hmm. And I'd be like, I ain't raking them. They're going to take care of it. Right? That's right. You could do that. I got a lot of leaves. I don't think you want that job. Or do you? <laughs> I'll take on anything, big or small. It doesn't matter to me. That's a good attitude. Uh, and then, uh, and then, so obviously you're a Hawkeye football fan, right? Like exactly, everybody. Exactly. Yep. I mean, we understand there's folks that aren't Hawkeye fans, but predominantly. So you grabbed one of these very cool Hawkeye Sensies, and I have like three Sensies in my house. It always smells good, which is secretly like hiding the smell of kids and dogs. Mm -hmm. um, so this is a Hawkeye Sensi that you're giving away. That's right. So what do I have to do to win this? I got to go on Facebook. What do you want me to do? Because I really would like to win it. Like us on Facebook okay. at Lincoln Lawn Care. Perfect. That's it? That's it. That's easy. Yep. Great. So if you're a Hawkeye football fan and you're on Facebook, a billion people are on Facebook, uh, search and like Lincoln Lawn Care. Yep. And then uh, we're, it's customizable, so we'll oh, have, nice. to, uh, have to order it. You can pick out what you want. Okay. And, uh, my lady is uh, Kristen Tolle, and her number is 319-572-4392. If you want any sensey stuff, give her a call. That's a nice little plug she got there. You, yeah, I see what happened there. Exactly. Tell her uh, one of those leather-scented tin things for the old vintage sound car. I'll see what I can I do. I don't know why I like that. Like, when I go to Miracle Car Wash, there's another plug. They're always like, do you want any of the, the little thing they give you with the wash? And I'm like, yeah, leather. Every time. I don't know why. Is that weird? Yeah, that's, yeah. I can't explain it. I just like that in a car. It, it People think I'm crazy. I don't know. I like the new car smell. I don't know. There's, what, I don't know what whatever. Is they that put a sensey it, thing? I don't know if it's a sensey thing or not. I know there's like. Or you uh, just creep around car dealers? <laughs> <laughs> no, no. <laughs> oh, the guy from Lincoln Lawn Care is here. Close all the doors. No, but uh, yeah, I know what you mean. Uh, try leather though. See how you like that. I'll give it a try. Yeah. All right. Well, listen. Get on Facebook, Lincoln Lawn Care, or if you're looking at your house uh, and you're thinking, "Oh my gosh, this <laughs> looks terrible," uh, and you're tired of getting. Um, uh, the thorn bush stab in the arm, <laughs> like myself. I really think next year, next spring, I'm going to talk to you about like, because I'm assuming you could show up and pull these thorn bushes out and we could put something else in. Yep. Right? Okay. I'm dead serious about this because why are there thorn? Why? Why? They're not my favorite thing to do. Yeah, either. but it's no, but like, who thought it was a good idea? Oh, you know, we should put out front thorn bushes. Yeah, so that every time we cut the grass, we get stabbed. Oh, yeah, that's a good idea. I don't know. I'd say we make them cut them out if they're the ones that wanted them in there in the first place. The previous owner? I don't know. She's I don't a nice know. lady, man. I can't call her and be like, hey, I know you haven't lived here. We're going on three years, but <laughs> these thorn bushes are a real pain in my, you know what. Uh, but I was thinking about that. So uh, give everybody the phone number for Lincoln Lawn Care. Ready to go. 563-299-7181. You can call us or text me at that number. Beautiful. 
call, text, and Christmas decoration and lights and get you ready for the least favorite four-letter word, and that's snow. And if you're a Hawkeye football fan, jump on Facebook, Lincoln Lawn Care. I'll put a link on the radio station Facebook page. I'll share your post. I know I can't win it, but I'll do you a solid. Okay. Sounds now, good. if a leather car <laughs> since he appeared in the vintage sound car, that wouldn't be the worst idea. Wink. Have your person call my people, okay? I can do that. Good deal. All right. Lincoln Lawn Care, they'll take care of you. And if you have leaves in your backyard that are about to, ooh, you don't even want to look at them. That's how I felt when I pulled into my driveway. Let the crew take good care of you.